All right, hello everybody and welcome back. I'm Sean T.D. Stewart, the Home Gamer. And today we're going to be cracking open the Magic the Gathering Chaos Pack. This came from Walmart and it's supposed to be uh, six uh, somewhat randomly assorted booster packs from recent Magic sets and one promo card. We're going to go ahead and crack this open. I have TCG player up to uh, check prices of any rares we pull. So we can see if we get anything of value. This set uh, costs, this pack costs $20 at Walmart, which is a slight discount because you get six packs. Generally speaking, a pack will be $4. So six by four is 24. So you kind of get a $4 savings off the top. Ultimately, the value of this will rely upon what you pull from the packs. Um, and hopefully we get some good packs in this. So let's go ahead and pop it open and see what we have inside. All right. So our promo is Thalia's Lancers. It's a foil uh, rare. First strike for four. When Thalia's Lancers enters the battlefield, you may search your library for a legendary card, reveal it, put it into your hand, and shuffle your library. Let's look this up. It's probably... Not worth very much, maybe 30 cents if you're lucky. With all those Lancers, that's loading. And that's our promo. It, actually, it's worth, uh, looks like it's worth 58 cents. The foil is worth uh, over a dollar in some cases here. Oh, pretty nice. Uh, or as low as 20 cents. So it kind of ranges in price. Uh, this printing is pretty cheap. This, this printing is only like 25 cents for the foil. All right, so we have a pack of Conspiracy, Battle for Zendikar, Eldritch Moon, Fates Reforged, ooh, and two packs of Origins. That's actually pretty good right there. We'll save those for the end. And we'll put Conspiracy number three. I guess Eldritch Moon there. Uh, this is in the car on Phase 3 Forge. This is the order we're going to open. We're going to do Phase 3 Forge first, and we'll lay out the packs. I'll lay them out by, I guess, color, maybe. So we got Douse and Gloom. And uh, War Flare. Arash and Cleric. Whisk Away, Civic Host, Formless Nurturing, Sand Steep Outcast, Timur Battle Rage, Hunt the Weak, Fearless Awakening, Cash Defenses, Hungry Yeti, Shu Yun, The Silent Tempest is the Rare. And this is interesting. So it has prowess. It's a human monk, three drop with prowess, which should be pretty good. So we'll type it in. Shu Yun, the Silent Tempest. Ah, uh, 19 cents. I'll put the rares right here. And we also got a rare foil, Arc Bond. Choose our creature whenever that creature is dealt damage this turn. It deals that much damage to each other creature and player. That's interesting. That could board wipe. And the foil version of this is about 25 cents. And it's also a rare. And a Rugged Highlands. That's the land. Alright, next. Battle for Zendikar. Anticipate. Sludge Crawler. It's a devoid one. That's colorless, technically. Earthen Arms. Another Devoid, Incubator Drone. So now Drawzy, another Drawzy. 
boiling earth. McKinney Patrol. Lava Step Raider. Ooh, this is good. This is Goblin. I'm gonna put that in my Goblin deck. So let's we'll set, we'll set them aside. Smite the Monstrous. Monstrous. Kozilek's Channeler. Another Eldrazi. Touch of the Void. Another the Void. Serene Steward. Another Artifact Creature Thopter. Uh, Pilgrim's Eye. That's an artifact. Blighted Cataract. Add one to your mana pool, sacrifice to draw two cards. That's, that's decent. Let me see what that's worth. So Blighted Cataract is uncommon. Uh, pretty cheap. Ten cents. Shambling Vent. Netherland. When it enters the battlefield tapped, add a, a white or black. Then you can also become a 2 3. Let's see what Shambling Vent is worth, if anything. Seems pretty decent. Shambling Vent is uh, $1.29. Not bad. And a full art land. It's fancy. And a token. All right. Eldritch Moon. Oops. Messing up my stacks. All right. We got Waxing Moon. So transform a creature. Nice. Uh, drag Under. Borrowed Grace. Thraben Foul Blow. <laughs> Thraben or Thraben Foul Bloods. Primal Druid, Steadfast Cather, Spontaneous Mutation, Bold Impeller, Campaign of Vengeance. Uh, not bad. Uh, give No Ground, Incendiary Flow. That's pretty good, actually. Um, Emrakul's Evangel. That is the rare. I don't recognize this one. I guess sacrifice it for tokens. So. Pretty cheap, 11 cents. Rare. Uh, Cryptolith Fragment. It's an artifact. Enters tapped. Add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Each player loses one life. Ooh, that's pretty good. Actually, I like that. Let me look that up real quick. That'll be pretty good for Commander. Crypt. Do with fragment. Where's the value? 83. Oh, the foil is 83. Uh, the red card is 13 cents. Uh, it's an artifact. And also a land at times. Uh, foil Alchemist Greetings deals 4 damage to target creature. And we got a flip card and a human wizard token. Alright, Conspiracy. Jeering Homunculus. That's cool. Ember Beast. Oops. Take the foil, put it here. Ember Beast. Child of Night. Copperhorn Scout. Raise the Alarm. Leo Vold's Operative. Wild Griffin. Murder. Nice. That's a good card. Murder. I can't remember how much murder goes for. I think it's got a little bit of value. 
uh, Vaporkin. Yeah, murders only ten cents. Vaporkin. A deputized protester. Burn away. Coveted peacock. Manoplasm. And our rare, or mythic rare, bum bum bum. Ooh, it's a planeswalker. Conspiracy. Mythic rare planeswalker. You gotta be kidding me. That's pretty good. Uh, I get zero to exile, enter one or, or up to one target creature, return that creature to battlefield under the zone of control at the beginning of the next turn. You lose two life. Interesting. Each opponent loses two life, you gain two life. That's a good. Each opponent discards a card and you draw a card. This is an interesting one. There's no plus up. So let's go ahead and uh, pull Kaya Ghost Assassin and see if this is worth anything. It is a Mythic Planeswalker. It's a $10 card. That's a $10 card hit right there. That's very nice. Hired Heist. That's a conspiracy card. That's a... I guess I'll put it in blue. Or... Yeah, put it there for now. And then a Goblin Token. Alright. Moving on. Let's hurry this up. Got like a minute and a half. Uh, three minutes, sorry. Yoked Ox. Catacomb Slug. Demolish. Even Battle Priest. Nice. Hitchclaw Recluse, Bone to Ash, Fiery Impulse, Return Centaur, Wild Instincts, Guardian Automation, or Automaton, excuse me, Cruel Revival, Clash of Wheels, Eye Blight Massacre, and our rare is Oath. Orbs of Warding. Uh, it gives you Hexproof, and if a creature would deal damage to you, prevent one of that damage. That is pretty good. Let's look that up real quick. I already have this card. I like it. Orbs of Warding. Boom. And we got a land. Basic land. We'll put that over here. And Orbs of Warding is a well, in a foil, it's a dollar. Otherwise, it's 38 cents. Still pretty decent. And final pack. Infectious Bloodlust. Acroian Jeller. Thornbow Archer. Cobble Brute. Farika's Disciple. Disperse. Alchemist Vial. Unholy Hunger, Topan Freeblade, Claustrophobia, Cruel Revival, Meteorite. Nice, that's mana of any color, deals two damage when it enters in. Uh, probably not worth very much. Meteorite, but anything that's kind of. Put that there. Yes, not worth anything. Enthralling Victor, and our rare is Nissa's Revelation. Scry 5, reveal the top card of your library. That's a creature card. You may draw cards equal to its power, and you gain life equal to its toughness. That's for 7, though, so it's not very efficient. Uh, apostrophe S, Revelation, right? Oh, I did this wrong. Uh, a... Yes. And this is Revelation. Yeah, 12 cent rare. Basic land. And that's it. Alright, so our best card. Let's cover this again. We got this is Revelation, Orbs Awarding. The Kai Ghost Assassin is the best one. We got the Foil Alchemist Greetings, the Amoracles of Angle, Shambling Vent, Blighted Cataract. Oh, that's a. Uh, that's not a. There we go, a rare. Arc Bond. The all these Lancers, and Shu Yun the Silent Tempest. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you all next time.